Hi Warham fam, welcome back to our channel. I'm Debbie. I'm Darren. And this is Victory. La, da, 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 da. Now, it's Russell Crate UK this it week, is. which is very much Darren's box. Yep. So, me and Victor have been practicing. Yep. And he's got a wrestle move down. Is he? Yeah, he's got I the rest. I can pin him. Yeah. Tap out. Your shoulders aren't down. Go on, tap out. He did. Yay! He tapped out. <laughs> I know, he's been true. You're so clever. Yes. <laughs> You're going to get me now. Don't be a sore lo loser. <laughs> no, it's not friendly, is it? No. Yeah. Anyway. Talk about tapping out. There's there's a bit bit from a <laughs> submission specialist hey! in, in this month's one. I'm looking forward to. There you go. I've tapped so, out. Yay. All right. <laughs> Sorry. So, bit from a submission specialist this month. I'm looking forward to. So, we haven't had, we haven't actually opened it. The the thing. The yeah, tape is The, the tape is open. Said about that, didn't yeah, they? Yeah. So the tape but, the tape is open. But it's our regular post guy, oh. and he is fabulous. His yeah. name's Richard, and mm. he is fabulous. Yeah. Right, so, we shall see what we shall see this month. Right, so we're going to open Daddy's crate now. Yeah. Daddy doesn't even get to open his own bloody crate, I know. <laughs> I know, it's either that. Oh. Ooh. 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 Ways to recycle your crate. Yeah. Right. You've got... Use for extra storage. That's boring. Can't read the next one. Stand oh, your, your wrestling, wrestling figures, figures on inside... On, oh, on or inside Let the your kitty sit inside. We haven't got kitties. We've got, <laughs> got a Vicky. <laughs> recycle. However, do not recycle with your cat with your Vicky or your it. hamster. <laughs> you can use it to box up for a present. Again. Not with the Vicky or the cat. No. <laughs> um, you can store boring paperwork in it, which, to be fair, let's face it, yeah. is boring paperwork. It's the only thing that's going to make interest. My personal favourite, and Victor's personal favourite, is build a fort. Yeah. We want to do that, don't we? We do. He says it's boring in there. There's no wizard stuff or nothing, Mum. No. I know. Yeah. He says you usually get me in the wizard one. I don't think I've got any wizard ones now. Oh. Right. Next month, we've got the exclusive, exclusive British Bulldog t-shirt next month. I remember him from years ago. And he used, he used to be, he used to be the, the young lad that was with um, Big Daddy. Do you remember that little, the little, the little skinny thing that was with Big Daddy you, when we were seen, little I'd no it, it would have been after you saw Big it would have been before you saw Big Daddy yeah, when it no, was on the TV he's way too young for that too but no I saw Big Daddy when I uh, went to Pontins he's not in too young, Blackpool he's dead. <laughs> oh isn't he British Bulldog's dead oh. I think it was Giant Haystacks as well with him mm. not with him with nah. Big Daddy what we got I don't know you got Oh, eight, we won't. That's, eight, that's got five. some sort of code on it. So I'll put me some right. over there. Yeah, you. Uh, with it, your stuff. As a Wrestle Crate subscriber, you can enjoy Wrestle Carnival, Carnival of Champions in full. Scan the link. That's why I got my thumb over it. Okay. <laughs> oh, and over that one. <laughs> So yeah, so that's obviously that's a free match. So yeah, it's, it's all right. Well, you were looking really confused with that. <laughs> Here comes the money. Here comes the money. Oh, that was so funny. He looked at me then. Here comes the money. Is Shane McMahon? I'm pretty sure that was Victor. Shane McMahon. As you, you may, you may all know, boxing it's, the, it's the son of son of the person who used to run WWE. Spoiler alert: he yeah. doesn't anymore. It's now now run by Triple H. But yes, it's very nice. It's a card holder of some sort. It's a holder bit. 
yes, told you, debit card or credit card or whatever. Yeah. Whoop. Clever we boy. Oh, we've got a pin. Jericho. Yay. Yeah, Chris Jericho. The Jericho Chronicles Tour. Inside the ropes exclusive pin. And oh, there's three pins to collect. Exclusive event exclusive. Oh, WrestleCrate exclusive and WrestleCrate Chase. So you're going to get two of them on here anyway, because the event one would have one of them. Jericho is also on <laughs> bed with Fozzie as well. So. <laughs> oh, he's taking himself to bed. Is he? Yeah. Yeah. Do we need to get him? I think you do, yeah. yeah. Right, guys. So. Yep. Daddy's just put Victor away. That looks like a poster jewel, yeah. There's something falling out of it. Oh. Looks like a poster cheap. There you go. Oh, there's, there's something else in there, wasn't it? I don't know. Oh, hello. Uh, what have we got here? Pro Wrestling by Beyond Bar Gorilla. Join the Beyond Gorilla merch newsletter. 15% off your next order. Oh! Ah, it's the picture that's on there. Oh, look at that. That's quite wicked. He's very purple, isn't he? Do you remember those rubbery heads with the googly eyes? Sort of alien-y type things. He sort of reminds me of one of them. What are they called? I don't know. They didn't, they sort of, they were mostly head, not body. Hmm. But yeah, that's a quite a nice like picture. The arc, but not, it was hmm. more rounder head. Hmm. I'm going to have to look that up now. Hmm. Right. Do you know who that? Do you know what? Beyond Grill, no. I'm sorry, I can tell you it's Beyond Grill. Um, one down at the bottom, bottom corner on my side, looks like Will Ospreay. I can't tell who the others are in it. This is just wrestling, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Oh. So that's not Iron Maiden then? It looks like Iron Maiden. Yeah. Oh, was that? It says Warhorse. Remember that, that picture we got we got signed last month? Do you want me to get it the bloke, out of the... the bloke who look, bloke who looks like heavy metal guy. Anyway. It don't want to let me out. Shrip it. Huh. That guy who looked like a heavy metal guy that we've signed. Yeah, he looked like Iron Maiden. Yeah, I say it's it's been oh, done. So it's it's been done to look like Iron Maiden, isn't it? So is this long sleeve or what is it? I don't know. I, I haven't opened it, darling. You have. It looks like it's done on Iron Maiden Killers. He looks like a monkey, doesn't he, that one? Oh, it's Eddie. Oh, no, it's because he's got no it's, teeth, no yeah. gums, no lips. I've yeah. got there in the end. War Horse, World Tour. He looks a bit like Kiss as well on the eyes. No, so it's, it's Eddie. It's done on, but it's done with mm -hmm. paper paint. And it's done on like... Um, oh, and it is only short sleeve as well, by the way, people. Hmm. Yeah, Which is just as well because you don't really like long sleeves. No, I don't know. But that's a nice t-shirt, eh? It is, yeah. <laughs> Even though it confused me. <laughs> because it confused me. I still don't know who Warhorse is. I should probably look it up, really. <laughs> See him, really? <laughs> don't look at me. I'll get confused. <coughs> oh, The here? Undertaker was my favourite. The best of New Jack. Oh. New Jack. Oh, he's another. New Jack is, or was, I don't know if he's still going. Mayhem still alive. is as new, new Jack takes it. Yeah. To the extreme. Yeah, he threw a bloke off a, off the top and missed the tables and nearly, broke, nearly killed a bloke. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, in real, yeah, he, he actually did. It fucked up. It, it messed up. Did he? <laughs> yeah. Did he, did he, um, yeah. Yeah. Did he mean to do, I mean, did he, was it one of those ones where he didn't mean to do it? But it was staged, really. Or was it one of those ones where he just Debatable. got carried away with the... Debatable. New Jack's a bit of a head case. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, so sure you, you could see nice all, you could see all, you all marks on his head. Yeah. Right, you'll see all marks on his head there. That's where he cuts, he, cuts his forehead so much. Oh, 
<laughs> well, you got a DVD of him. Anyway. We got a DVD. Yep. Who's this? A very young man. Liam Slater. He looks like somebody from Georgie Sign. Shore, doesn't he? Oh, I've got no idea who Liam Slater is. I'm guessing he's British. This is a British box, and Liam's quite a. Oh, it's Irish, isn't it? Liam is. Yeah, but it doesn't mean he. <coughs> thank you. He's, he's he he is a nice looking lad. Not but so look. Apparently, Liam Slater. Uh, he's a pretty professional wrestler. He's currently working for New Generation Wrestling, where he performs under his own name. Well, yeah. Darren looked that up, actually. I must admit, I did realise something. I'm, I'm looking at him. I, he's very young. And then I suddenly realised I have got to the age now where I can say somebody looks very young with facial hair. He's 20 years younger than me. He was born in 1993. <laughs> in 1993? Yeah. He looks younger than he looks. He'll be, he'll be 29 this year. Oh, well. <laughs> I don't know what moisturiser he's using. It might be worth getting on Messenger and asking him. Yeah. Mind you, it does help when you're very... Yeah, <gasps> oh, I like that one. I recognise him. Yeah, the best there is... <laughs> The best there was and the best there ever will be. Oh, Brett, Hitman Brett the Hitman Hart. Hart. Mm. Did you used to like him when I was young, watching wrestle? I liked him. Oh, well, I watched it. I started watching it years ago when you had the first. I think it was on. You had, It was on Sky, but it was on Sky Movies because you had to. Because you had to subscribe to Sky Movies. Per bit, mm. per per actual film at that point in time, because I it was it was what, it was the early early days of Sky. I think the first one I saw was WrestleMania Four. I think <laughs> we had. Or was it five? Mega powers explode. We didn't get Sky because my dad didn't like the look of the dishes, and ironically, they have got them now. Mind you, they're mm. nowhere near as big as they used to be. Mm. Um, I mean. The size they used to be, they looked like they could pick up bits from NASA, to be honest. Uh, but <sighs> we had cable. That's what we had. We had cable later on. We got Sky One and whatnot. This was before cable. This was before NTL. Oh, yeah. I can't this was. remember what it was called, actually. No, no, no. This was, the cable was before, before NTL. I mean, so it was before the, before the oh yeah, when, well before it was that. when video it was when when they first came out. I mean, I was still. It wasn't until I think I got into double digits that they actually bought bought it out because, um, I mean, I remember being younger and the kitchen TV used to be black and white. I can remember when it was just four channels. Oh, sorry. I am not ancient, <laughs> I might add. And, right. It you was know. WrestleMania 5, the first one, which was the 2nd of April, 1989. Mm -hmm. That's, that was the first wrestling one I watched of American wrestling, which was WWF. But we always used to watch World of Sport, which was on... Um, it was on ITV, I think. It was um, on Saturday... Afternoons, you had ones like Big Daddy, John uh, Giant Hastings. Haystacks, Kendo Nagasaki, uh, <laughs> ones like that. My brother used to watch a lot of it, and say so I, I'd watch bits. Hmm. But I always thought, I always thought the Undertaker was the was my favourite. The Undertaker, I used to love the Undertaker. It's not surprising. I it's think anybody that's a little bit more um people were booing him. I was I was cheering yeah. in the crowd. I mean, look, he's <laughs> he's moody, he's grumpy, yeah. But it's <laughs> only a facade, people. He didn't he didn't he kept that up all the time. I know he did. I know he did. Amazing, amazing guy. Yeah, whenever he was seen seen in public he always kept up that persona. I went out with 
buff as well as rugby players, so it didn't really. Because yeah. there was never the, any of this emu thing. The emu thing came in. Emu. I'll, I'll keep doing emo. that tonight. Sorry. Emo. emo thing only came out. Ooh. It was never a thing in my day. And again, if you find yourself using the words never a thing in your day. <laughs> I mean, I turned, we were having a discussion. Is that the last thing in there, isn't it? Yeah, it was. the last thing. Yeah. No, we were so having, no, we were having was a discussion a... about it, yeah. weren't we, Monday? Yeah. Anyway, I'm going to use that on Quick yeah. Corner, so we will we go into that. We haven't, we haven't uh, yeah, done what the favourite item, my favourite item was probably a t-shirt, actually. Or the, the, or the, the autograph. I mean, it's a very good box. I mean, the box cost twenty six ninety nine. With free delivery to the UK, or including delivery to the UK, um, and I, I mean, <laughs> I mean the, I'm, I mean, I well, you've got the T-shirt, you've got the DVD, you've got two autographs. I mean, you're not telling me that the, the Brett the Hitman whole autograph pictures not worth more than twenty six ninety nine already, just on his own. <laughs> you know, what I mean? you go to, you go to one of these. Conventions and bits oh, like yeah. that, and they'll be charging 30, 40, 50 quid easily. Well, we paid 20 quid what? for Traeguard from Nightmare. Well, right, too. Yeah. Lovely man. <laughs> He's fabulous. He yeah. really is. He hasn't lost it at all no. either. <laughs> people used to go up to him and say, What was the red gem? What did people want that for? sort of thing. And then I didn't know I'd have to make it up on the spot because that's they didn't he didn't he wasn't told anything I mean that was far too organised no but that just shows actually what a blooming good actor he was mm. well it is <laughs> he's not dead no you know well he wasn't the last time we saw him no anyway hope you enjoyed that yes. if you did <laughs> give us a like ring the little give bell subscribe ring the little bell um you enjoy the waffling on at the end <laughs> Guys, seriously, <laughs> you need to join our Friday group yeah, so on the And also, um, uh, we we show a witchcraft um, bit on Wednesdays. Which is Debbie which doing crafts. Which is me doing craft bits. Um, whether it's something of my own invention or or whether it's something, or something that else I've or got in or what have you. Hmm. Um, but we do lots of different unboxing bits, whether it be craft. Most of it's witchy. Craft, witchy, geeky, uh, the rest of the one. There was a lot of Harry Potter. There's been a Game of Thrones one. Yeah, there was a lot of Harry Potter. There's not a lot of Harry Potter boxes in the UK now. And there's... Geek, uh, Click Crate is another one of yours. Yeah, it's a yeah. geeky one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. We've got, we got the big, big one coming yeah. on that. So it's definitely worth ringing that bell and yeah. um, subscribing. Yeah. And... A happy husband makes a happy wife, so yeah. he gets so excited. <laughs> but no. I get so depressed when the numbers go down. You do, don't you? Yeah. Take it to heart. <laughs> yeah, please. I mean, cause <laughs> do you realise, I mean, my brain is mostly half functioning at the best of times. <laughs> you know, if I'm trying to do craft work and boost Darren's confidence that nobody loves him, or that people do love him really... Then, you know, he's not that sensitive. I am joking. <laughs> but the point is that it's really nice because we love you guys contacting us. So yeah. if you lurk in there, we've had quite a few lurkers coming forward. Mm, yeah. um, any questions, we always answer on a Friday. Yeah. I know we ramble on a bit, but we're yeah, essentially yeah. good. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, as ever, guys, yeah. stay different. Yeah. Have a good one. Bye. Bye.